No more post-it notes, the accountants say. Apparently we use too many. To them it's just another expense. You can use scrap paper, they tell us. One sheet makes four pieces. So they purchase a stack paper cutter for $1,199 and set to the task. Monthly expenditures for tape rise exponentially. These cost-cutting measures make post-it notes a new commodity. Graham in sales has a client, someone in Fort Worth, I think, who sent her ten packs as a gift. Ten packs. Now post-it notes are as valuable as ramen noodles or honey buns in prison. And Graham becomes the new shot caller. She leaves a different note on my desk each day to rub it in. There's no escaping it, no matter how hard I try. Last night after work, at the barbecue grill and Chinese food buffet, I saw a message on the cork board. It was right there between the dog-sitting flyers and real estate business cards. Save yourself, it read, in jagged, scrawling letters written upon a yellow post-it note.